high traders. We've been monitoring the Kiwi dollar to try and catch the end of its retracement, and we suspect that time could be approaching. Since breaking out of this larger coiling pattern, a bearish trend has been developing, although it has been a little messy in places. Still, it's traced from these lows and has stalled around the 8 day average and 50% retracement level. So, wait and see if bearish momentum can return and break yesterday's low. Keep in mind that New Zealand released employment data overnight and it could be key for the next week's cash rate decision. And then, of course, we've also got the FMC tomorrow and NFP on Friday, so there's plenty of volatility to drive this currency pair. In terms of positioning, we're seeing a pickup of bearish interest on the New Zealand dollar, and as it's far from sentiment and extreme, we see potential for further downside. But ultimately, we suspect RBZ are headed for a rate cut, so weak employment data would certainly help with that bias. I mean, the market is expecting a slightly dovish FMC meeting. It could prove bullish for the greenback if they stay quite neutral, as we'd expect. In which case, we're hoping to see this market top out over the next 48 hours or so.